We are back with another review today. You can see the table is full of boxes here. So without further ado, let's hop right into this review. We got some pickups from GameStop today. We got a box from the Funko shop. We got an eBay pickup over here. I think what we're gonna do is kind of scoot everything off. Let's see what we got in the box from the Funko shop. And then we'll move on from there. So we got some pretty good pickups today. I don't know which one this is. I assume it's from either the Charlie Day drop as him as a director or it's the Wolverine one based off where I'm at in regards to what has come. It looks like it is the latter. Let's see what we got. This is gonna be two of them in here. Cause I got one for Sin as well. Nice. Unmasked Wolverine, check that out. There is the Funko Shop sticker. Now I believe it is either the same head or a variation of the uh, Hugh Jackman one where they did the Unmasked Wolverine for the X2 movie. Uh, the MCU movie that they had, but neither here nor there. It is still Unmasked Wolverine. There is the side profile. It is him in the brown and yellow suit, which is nice. That is that 90s Wolverine that we all are so fond of. We'll leave those off over there to the side. Next, let's see what we got in the this tiny box from eBay. Let's see what we got here. It's like a box that's like not quite big enough to hold a pop. And I haven't ordered any sodas recently. Oh, sick. All right, cool. So we have them waiting on these. We got 1989 Batman the Movie Complete Set. So it's 143 glossy cards. I believe these are the white bordered ones. Here's some of the concept arts right there that they have in the set as well. Um, there is 22 stickers, I believe. Yeah, so they're the white bordered cards. They also had a yellow bordered card uh, set as well which I believe was either the same or a little bit different, but we're gonna check these out in another video. We'll go through the whole box and we'll check out what we ended up getting in this one, but that is an awesome pickup right there. Next, let's do uh, some of these smaller boxes from GameStop. Let's do that. Let's open up this one right here. This one got a little bit of crunch damage. I've been getting some FedEx deliveries now from GameStop. All right, cool. We did not cut that, thankfully. It's just kind of chilling in there with some paper. We got Gambit from the X-Men, which is pretty cool because we also got a Wolverine in this one. So that's pretty awesome on that. We got some we got some X-Men pickups in this video. Here, we'll pop out one of the Wolverines to chill next to Gambit. Next, we got a smaller box from GameStop, or I should say a medium box. I don't know, it's kind of small. This is a little poofy. All right, so it looks like we have one sorter in this one. Interesting. They all come from different places, so I've been buying some stuff on their website and I've been getting them from the stores, so like that's where that Gambit came from. Nice, we got Red Eyes Black Dragon right there from the Yu-Gi-Oh set. That is pretty cool for uh, a pickup on that because this is definitely one that was selling out on the site. Uh, they had like the Queen left, they had this one, and then uh, the uh, Persona 5 box, I believe was the other one I was trying to go after, but that one sold out. But we ended up scooping up one of those, which is great to have to hold on to. Next, we have the big box from GameStop, which feels like there is just honestly stuff floating around in the box. So let's see what we ended up getting in the box from GameStop. Now, again, this is one of those examples of stuff coming from a store. So let's put this over here. Oh my, check this out. It's literally just a pop floating around with some mystery minis in this box. All right, so anyway, let's get these minis out. We got some Fantastic Four, it looks like. We got some Marvel Avengers and then it looks like we have an office space pop to go with my Peter Gibbons. This is a Joanna. And that's all that's in that box. And uh, let's see her damage, if there's any. Looks like the box itself just has normal shelf wear on the bottom there with the sticker and all, but the box looks like it came in pretty decent shape, minus this little chip right there on the window, which sucks, but neither here nor there. What you gonna do? 
So what happens when you throw it in a, in a box? I mean, we should be lucky that there's no more damage than that. So let's do this. Uh, let's do the Fantastic Four ones first. These are only at GameStop, which means I might get a um, one in six Invisible Girl. There's also a Silver Surfer with the blaster. Now I have, I have that one. Uh, I have all of these in the front front row. I have all of these except for Namor and Doom. I don't have Mole Man. I have Skrull. I do not have whatever that is, and I think I actually do have both. Um, what's called Mister Fantastics, but. Is about looks like there's about three of them, four of them that I'm missing right here. I don't like I said, I have no idea who that is right there, but that one in 24 is one that we are missing from the set. So, mm, based off feel, I couldn't tell you what exactly it is or who it is. Ah, there we go. We got a Ben Grimm, pretty cool on that. Oh, so it's back in the box. We got a Ben Grimm from the Fantastic Four. Check that out. Pretty cool on that. He's actually a pretty cool figure to get. He is a one in six, just like the entire first wave of the Fantastic Four is. So you get all four of the Fantastic Four or one in six, so you're guaranteed to get lots of them if you buy a case. Let's see what we got in this one. Huh. No idea who this could be. Maybe Super Scroll? I don't know. Doesn't feel like Dr. Doom, I can tell you that. Let's see. Yeah, okay. Another Ben Grimm. Another Ben Grimm. I was feeling his, his brow. So we got another Ben Grimm. All right. So let's see what we got for the third one. So far, we got duplicates. I only bought three boxes for the Fantastic Four because that's all they let you buy on the website. So, yeah. Gonna do is this we're gonna we're gonna cut these open because I don't want to get I gotta clean that blade I got a bunch of tape on it from this GameStop box what did we get oh snap no way we got Doctor Doom no way Victor Von Doom himself check this out wow that is great which one is he he is the one in twelve GameStop exclusive we got Doctor Doom that is badass oh man dude. So now we're just missing Mole Man, Namor, and whoever this little creature is. Looks like Gollum. We're missing him. Well, that is great. And he's actually, out of all the ones that I'm missing, him and Namor are probably the two that I wanted the most. But Doom was definitely... Yeah, wow, that's awesome. Hey, great pull on that. That's super sweet. That's a great pull. Wow. All right, cool. I know it's not probably big for you guys, but I definitely like the Doctor Doom character. So having that little mini is going to be neat. Plus, I got the pops to put it next to anyway to take a nice photo op. Yeah, look at all that tape I got on my blade from my GameStop box. Pretty wild. Let's see what we ended up getting. Nice! We got a Hulk! No way, dude! That's like the only one I wanted from this wave, and we ended up pulling it. The War Machine would be cool. That's one in 72. Ant Man would be neat. Iron Man would be cool as well. We got the Hulk. That's the one I wanted anyway. That's awesome. All right. I said I'm buying three boxes. I, they're one in six, so I have a, a decent chance of pulling a Hulk, which is what I wanted anyway. Put these back up here. We got the two Ben Grimm's right there, which is neat. All right. So far, we're off to a good start on the Avenger boxes. Like I said, if I pull an Iron Man out of here, I'll be, I'll be happy. Iron Man, Ant-Man, or the War Machine would be cool. That yeah, Ronin looks kind of neat, too. Let's see. So what we got in this bag? We got one more left from this haul right here, which is pretty cool. Who do we get? We got an Avenger. Nice, we got Thor. All right, cool. That's pretty cool, actually. They're, they're very, very much stylized like the vinyls um, in regards to how the, the eyes are done and everything. We'll crank his head down just a little bit. There's Thor. We got Hulk. Crank his head down just a little bit, too. He's got his, what, nano suit on, or that suit. I have not seen any of the MCU movies, so, again, what the information that I know about this stuff is probably not accurate. So, yes. All right, let's see what we got in the last mini here that we ended up getting. So we got a half case of mixed Marvel minis here. And we got two pulls that I actually wanted. What else did we get? Nice, we got another Hulk. All right, cool. So that is a duplicate. 
which is cool. So I got two duplicates. I got duplicates of pretty much the same character. Hulk and, and Thing are basically kind of based off each other. But we also picked up a Doctor Doom and a Thor, which is pretty neat. So pretty good haul today on this one, I could say. We got a Joanna from Office Space. We got a Gambit from the X-Men. We got two Wolverines unmasked from the Funko Shop. Red Eyes Black Dragon from the Yu-Gi-Oh! set. We got a full case set of the 1989 limited edition Batman Tops set. And uh, yeah, some pretty cool mini pickups, which is awesome on that. So let me know down in the comments below, what was your favorite mini and pop from this particular pickup? What'd you think of the 1989 Batman card set? Are you excited for me to open that and check out some of the cards uh, from that particular era? Uh, let me know down in the comments below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Want more content like this? Subscribe for more because I do reviews every single day. So looking for that. And have a great rest of your day.